two mothers with similar stories of tragedy losing their daughters after they say they went missing. Both are pushing for change to protect missing people with disabilities. Tonight, News 3 reporter Antoinette Del Bell has an update to one of their missions and explains why they're now banding together to do more. Sometimes your mission and purpose finds you. Sean Year Wilson's mission began shortly after the devastating loss of her daughter, Jamil Hill, in October. She pushed for new legislation to better protect missing adults with autism. The bill is now expected to pass the Senate this week with the hopes of becoming law. For so long, our friends and family members with disabilities have really been pushed to the wayside and it's long overdue. Jamil had autism and other developmental disabilities. When she didn't come home one night, the missing child with autism alert did not go out. The cutoff age is 17. Jamil was 29. Two days after her disappearance, Chesapeake police found her body. Her mom says she likely fell and drowned. The new law drafted by delegate Cliff Hayes would include everyone with autism, regardless of age. We're honoring the life of Jamil by making sure that this doesn't happen to anyone else. That's her right there. That's what I have left in my daughter. Michelle Rushello also lost her daughter after she went missing. Like Jamil, Ashley Sarasol was 29. She had intellectual disabilities and mental illness, but not autism. Rushello says her daughter didn't qualify for any missing person alert. Ashley's body was found several weeks later in Gloucester. Police are still investigating how she died. Her mother believes the bill doesn't go far enough. It's not enough. There are 61 million disabled adults in the United States. And the bulk of the population is being disregarded. Delegate Hayes says a new bill to include all disabilities likely wouldn't pass until next session. Rushello and her mother fear that could be too late. This is not something you can wait on. There's going to be deaths. Because yeah. of their waiting. Meantime, they're joining your Wilson's fight to get a new, more inclusive alert program pushed on a national level, ensuring both their daughter's legacies endure. My daughter is smiling down. She is smiling down on us. It's like, Mom, you go, you go. Antoinette Delbell, News 3.